गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स इट्स ए क्रुशियाल पीरियड फॉर नॉट ओनली इंडिया बट ऑल्सो वर्ल्ड सो एज यू आर दी ग्रोइंग फ्यूचर्स ऑफ इंडिया ऑल वी ऑल यू मोस्ट यू बे दी गाइडलाइंस ऑफ गवर्नमेंट टू प्रिभेट दि करोना एंड सिंपली स्टे इन होम एंड स्टे एंड स्टे सेफ सो लेट अस् डिस्कस दि ए सेक्सुआल रिप्रोडक्शन अफ लिविंग अर्गानिजिम्स सिंपली वी कैन से दि प्रोसेस बाय हुईज एन अर्गानिजिम प्रड्यूसेस दि इंडिविजुआल्स अफ इट्स ओन टाइप इज नोन एज रिप्रोडक्शन फर्दर दि रिप्रोडक्शन इन हुईज टू पेरेन्ट्स इनवल्व एंड देन इट इज कल्ड सेक्सुआल रिप्रोडक्शन फर्दर दि रिप्रोडक्शन प्रोसेस इन हुईज देन इट इज कल्ड ए सेक्सुआल रिप्रोडक्शन तो टूडे टूडे टपिक इज ए सेक्सुआल रिप्रोडक्शन अफ लिविंग अर्गानिजिम्स फैक्ट इज दैट यूजुआली लोयर ग्रुप अफ अर्गानिजिम्स सम लोयर एनिमल सच एज प्रोटूजुआ स्पेस सेलेंटेरेट्स परफर्म ए सेक्सुआल रिप्रोडक्शन सिमिलरली सम लोयर ग्रुप अफ प्लांट्स सच एज आलजी देन फंजी बैक्टीरिया परफॉर्म ए सेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन ए सेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन ऑफ ऑर्गेनिजम्स कंप्लीट्स इन डिफरेंट मेथड्स सच एज नंबर वन बोडिंग नंबर टू बाइनरी फिशन नंबर थ्री मल्टीपुल फिशन एंड स्पोरोलेसन रिपीट अगेन एसेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इज वन टाइप ऑफ रिप्रोडक्शन इन व्हिच ओनली वन पेरेंट इन्वॉल्व्स एंड यूजुअली सम लोयर ग्रुप ऑफ प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स परफॉर्म एसेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन बाय दिस डिफरेंट मेथड्स तो लेट अस डिस्कस फर्स्ट बोर्डिंग इन उड़िया कोली कोन और करकत गम बोर्डिंग इज ए सिंपल कॉमन मेथड ऑफ ए सेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन ड्यूरिंग व्हिच द पेरेंट ऑर्गेनिज्म प्रोड्यूसेस स्मॉल आउटग्रोथ्स फ्रॉम इट्स बॉडी सो द आउटग्रोथ इज नोन एज बॉड सो द बॉड ऑन फर्दर डेवलपमेंट ग्रोज इनटू ए कंप्लीट ऑर्गेनिज्म and uh, later on it detaches from the parent body and independently grows as a new individual boarding is one type of uh, uh, asexual reproduction during which parent organism produces small outgrowth from its body so the outgrowth is known as bud so the bud later on uh, grows into a complete organism and then it detaches from parent body and independently grows as a new individual boarding is common in yeast hydra some sponges so let us discuss boarding in hydra बोर्डिंग इन हाइड्रा हाइड्रा इज ए सेलेंटरेट हाइड्रा इज ए सेलेंटरेट इट इज कॉमनली नून एज फ्रेश वाटर पलिप हाइड्रा रिप्रोड्यूसेस एसेक्सुअली बाय मींस ऑफ बोर्डिंग ड्यूरिंग इट्स फेवरेबल कंडीशन हाइड्रा इज ए फ्रेश वाटर पलिप it is grew it is lives in fresh water medium it is a sedentary animal hydra so uh, the body of hydra is just like 
इट इज हाइड्रा इट इज ए फ्रेश वाटर पलिप ड्यूरींग इट्स फेवरेबल कंडीशन इट प्रड्यूसे स्मल आउटग्रोथ सच आउटग्रोथ इज नोन एज बड सच बड लैटर ग्रुज इन टू ए पेरेन्ट एनिम ग्रुज टू फर्म ए न्यू हाइड्रा एंड देन इट डिटाचेस फ्रम पेरेन्ट बडी एंड इंडिपेडेंटली ग्रुज एंड मेन्टेन इट्स लाइफ देन लेट अस डिस्कस दि बडिंग अफ इस्ट बडिंग इन इस्ट ईस्ट इज ए फंगस इट्स साइंटिफिक नेम इज साकार माइसिस इट इज ए फंगस इट बिलंगस टू क्लास आस्को माइसिड्स तो ईस्ट इज ए यूनिसेलुलर फंगस इट्स होल बॉडी इज ए सिंगल सेल इट इज इट्स न्यूक्लियस इट इज इट्स वैक्यूल इट इज इट्स सेल वॉल देन इट इज साइटोप्लाज्म इट इज ए ईस्ट सेल और ईस्ट तो ड्यूरिंग फेवरेबल कंडीशन ईस्ट प्रोड्यूस स्मॉल आउटग्रोथ सच आउटग्रोथ इज नोन एज बॉड the uh, later on the, the nucleus of a parent parent yeast the nucleus of a parent yeast divides by mitosis method to form two daughter nuclei one of which enters to the bud then then such so bud detaches from parent yeast and becomes a new yeast cell it is called daughter yeast it is parent yeast it is daughter yeast it is parent yeast uh, some sometimes in some cases the daughter yeast separates from parent yeast and independently lives its life but in in some cases after uh, formation of a new yeast by budding method such new yeast attaches to parent parent body and further reproduces by budding method this process repeated this process repeats again and again as a result of which a number of yeast cell attaches and form a filamentous body it is called pseudomycelium pseudo mycelium so it is a budding of yeast then let, let us discuss binary fission इन उड़िया दी विभाजन इट इज वन टाइप ऑफ ए सेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इट इज कॉमन इन प्रोटोजुआ सच एज एमुईवा पारामेसियम Euglena, etc. Protozoa during its favorable condition, protozoa during its favorable condition reproduces asexually by means of binary fission. Binary fission is one type of mitosis cell division. During binary fission, the protozoan cell divides simply by mitosis method into two daughter individuals. Let it is a protozoan. its whole body is a single cell then its cell uh, divides by simply mitosis method to form two daughter individuals so binary fission is of three different types longitudinal binary fission binary fission is of three different types number 1 longitudinal binary fission ट्रांसभर्स बैनारी फिशन एंड सिंपल बैनारी फिशन सरी इरेगुलर बैनारी फिशन
longitudinal binary vision is found in case of paramecium. In case of paramecium, sorry, longitudinal binary vision is found in euglena, sorry, euglena. Uh, you, euglena is a fresh water produced one, its whole body is a single cell. During favorable condition, the nucleus of euglena first mitotically divide to form two daughter nuclei, then its whole body longitudinally constricts to form two individuals. So it is longitudinal binary fission. Then transverse binary fission is common in paramecium. Transverse binary fission is common in paramecium. Paramecium is a marine. Sorry, paramecium is a fresh water, free living protozoan. It is a ciliate protozoan. Its whole body covered with cilia. Then it is commonly known as slipper protozoan. Paramecium. Slipper any molecule is also known as. The paramecium has a two nuclei, one macronucleus, other one is a micronucleus. Two nuclei, macronucleus and micronucleus. During its binary fission process, the macronucleus amitotically divides to form two daughter nuclei and micronucleus divides mitotically to form two daughter nuclei. Then a transverse constriction develops which ultimately splits the parent animal into two daughter um, paramecia. So paramecium has a transverse binary fission means paramecium transversely divides to form two daughter paramecia. Then irregular binary fission is found in MOEVA. MOEVA is a common protozoan. Its body is a single cell. It has so many pseudopodia. During its reproductive stage, it withdraws its all pseudopodia and becomes rounded. Then it divides mitotically to form two daughter MOEVA. The mitotic division takes place in different direction, either in this way or in this way or in this way. So it is called irregular binary fission. The binary fission is one, one type of asexual reproduction which is most commonly uh, takes place in case of protozoa such as Amoeba, Paramecium, Euglena. Amoeba performs irregular binary fission means its binary fission takes place irregularly in any direction. And uh, transverse binary fission is found in Paramecium longitudinal binary fission found in Euglena. Then let us discuss multiple fission. Multiple fission. Multiple fission is one type of asexual or reproduction method. Multiple fission is one type of asexual reproduction. It is also common in some protozoa. It takes place during unfavorable condition. And during this method, a parent protozoa amitotically divides, amitotically divides to form many protozoa. So, so, it is also known, so it is known as multiple fission. And during this method, the protozoa first withdraw its pseudopodia and becomes rounded. It is a pullet, it is a protozoan, its whole body is a cell, it is its nucleus and cytoplasm. During multiple fission process, uh, the protozoan withdraws its pseudopodia and becomes rounded. Then it forms a thick cyst around its body. Then the, the nucleus of protozoan divides by a mitotic method, a mitotic method, awesome vibration to form a number of daughter nuclei, each nucleus then surrounded by cytoplasmic liquid, then uh, membrane formation takes place as a result of which many daughter protozoa develops inside a parent body. Then during favor uh, on the onset of favorable condition, the cyst wall ruptures and daughter individuals release to outside and, and independently grows as a new, new animal. It is multiple fission, it takes place during unfavorable condition 
एंड ड्यूरिंग दिस मेथड द न्यूक्लियस ऑफ प्रोटोजोआ डिवाइड्स बाय ए माइटोटिक डिवीजन ए माइटोटिक डिवीजन ए माइटोटिक डिवीजन देन लेट अस डिस्कस द लास्ट मेथड ऑफ ए सेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन दैट इज मल्टीपल फिशन स्पोरोलेशन Sporulation is one type of asexual reproduction. It is also common in protozoa, some protozoa, and it takes place during unfavorable conditions. During this method, the protozoa produces so many thick-walled resting cells called pseudopodial spore or spore. then after uh, onset of favorable condition is pseudopodial spore roots to form a new individual actually sporulation is not common in protozoa rather it is also found in uh, algae and fungi the process of formation of a spore is called sporulation so spore is the asexual reproductive cell which directly grows into new individual uh, this spore which has a flagella is called zoospore this spore which is non flagellated and uh, thick walled is known as hypnospore this spore which has no flagella this spore which is non motile is called aplanospore spore formation process is called sporulation it is common in protozoa then algae and fungi the um, spore which is motile which which possesses flagella is called zoospore which is thick wall is called hypnospore which has no flagella is called aplanospore then in case of fungi conidia uh, are also involved in the asexual reproduction method conidia conidia are one type of uh, um, detachable sporangia they are non motile and produce by some higher fungi and involve in asexual reproduction it is all about asexual reproduction another important point is that in some sponges in some sponges uh, the buds are produced inside their body some sponges produce buds in their body so the bud is known as gemule gemule is otherwise known as internal bud it is common in sponges and it also it uh, each gemule contains so many embryonic cells called archaeocytes each archaeocytes grows to form new individual gemule is otherwise known as internal bud it is found in sponges it is also involved in asexual reproduction so thank you it is all about asexual reproduction of organisms that's all